Thanks. What's the deal? Frank's meeting us. Why? He said he's running late. What else is new? Okay, let's go. Remember, if everything goes down, every man for himself. Okay, thanks. Don Crumley? South 21st? On my way. Where is he? Well, we're already here. Just do it. All right. Let's do this. Go around back. Johnny! Hey Johnny, where's Ray? They took him in. We got caught. Why are you late? I got caught up. I'm sorry. Where's Don? This makes the third time you're late. Johnny, just calm down. Talk calm down. Calm down. Don't tell me to calm down. One of our own. Who would do such a thing? Sickening. There he is. Take a look at this. Is that Morgan? Sure was. We should take him back to the station. Yeah. Who do you think could have done all this? Beats me. I guess we just wait for the coroner to get back with us. I mean, what more could we do? Exactly. You think the body we found two weeks ago has anything to do with this? No. We left a note with this one. Oh, that's right. My bad. I don't understand. How about we talk this over with some drinks? Yeah. Let's do that. Oh, wait. No, I can't. I got some work to do later tonight. Oh, that's a shame. Go on and drink some without me. I'll, I'll get back to you on Tuesday. Sounds good, John.
Hello? Hey, you. Who is this? You know who it is. <laughs> How you been? I've been better, but now that I'm talking to you... Oh, yeah? When will I see you again? That's a good question. I just got a new case this morning. Oh, really? Yeah. He was a guy that worked down at the station with us. Shot right in the back. Ouch. Yeah, get this. There was a note left with the word red on it. Red? As in the color? No, like the food. You know, I think it's getting back <laughs> by that time. You know I'm only kidding. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Well, I'm gonna let you go, Mary. It's nice talking to you. You too, Johnny. Oh, and don't forget about our date on Saturday. Wouldn't miss it for the world. Bye. Bye. Hello. Morning, Johnny. Now, I know today was your day off, but... But what? We got another body. Name was Don Crumlin. Don who? It's Crumley. You know him? What's that? Blue. The last one said red. Yeah. What do these mean? Call sign of some sort. You know him? No, no, uh, I didn't. Over the next couple of weeks, two more notes have been found. One sang first, the other sang now. Something's just not adding up. Johnny, Deputy Andy Griswold. Oh, hey, Deputy. I have important news. Well, what is it? Chief's dead. What happened? Chief was walking to his car. Body was dumped here. There's another note. What's it say? You. Me? No, just you. How long have you been working on this case, Johnny? Too long. Seems it's gotten personal. Let's hope not. This is getting out of hand. All these notes with random words on them. Two more have shown up. It and R. What is this? A riddle? Or absolutely nothing. Who are you? I'm losing it, Mary. Johnny, don't talk like that. My partner was just murdered three days ago. Whoever this is is coming after me now. Johnny, just calm down. Talk to me. I, I can't calm down. I'm paranoid. 
It's not that drastic. Not that drastic? Are you out of your mind? Mary, I'm sorry. Don't listen to me. Don't touch me! What is it with all these notes? Johnny. Johnny. Oh, sorry. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't get much sleep last night. Look, I know this case is becoming stressful, but we need a new lead. The coroner can't find a trace of, well, anything. Would you mind if I took some of these home with me? Knock yourself out. Pick them up when you're done for the day. I just, I don't know what to do, Father. Is it all the murders you're dealing with? It's everything, if I'm being honest. Like what? A fellow colleague of mine, my boss, and mm. even my lover. I'm so sorry to hear that, Johnny. I really am. I just, it's hard to sleep at night. Mm-hmm. What if I'm next? He leaves behind these one-worded notes that make no sense. Well, I don't mean to intrude on your profession, detective, but perhaps it's a phrase of some sort? Like, like a riddle? Maybe. When they're put together, they could all mean something. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe you're right, Father. Just continue to pray about this. The Lord will guide you through all of it. Now, I understand. I had to cut a meeting short, but I have a profession to go to. Thank you, Father, for everything. Of course. Take care, Detective Velasco. Oh! Hi! What is it that you need to confess? One of our own. Of our own. New Red, as in the color? color? Blue. 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 Call sign. Oh, no. What is it? Perhaps, Perhaps it's a phrase? phrase. Some, sort of Some sort of thing. Put it down, Johnny! Ray Wallace. I thought I was dead, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, I did. All these years, I just wanted to talk. Why'd you kill all those people? 
What makes you think I did it? I will shoot you dead right here. You left me for dead 10 years ago. Every man for himself, Ray. That's what you always told us. You leave me for dead? Get, get back, Ray. So I take what matters most to you. I'll do it right now. You won't kill me. You don't have it in you. Stop walking. We were once brothers, Johnny. Now, you're the biggest detective in New York. It felt real good watching the life drain right out of that pretty little girl of yours. What was her name? Mary? Oh! You shouldn't have done that. Oh! my name again. Detective Johnny Bullock. Peggy, it's Johnny. When you get the chance, send the corner over to my house. Things got a little messy. Will do. My old crime boss, Ray Wallace. I thought he was dead years ago. That was the idea, anyway. He did it all. Officer Morgan, our old friend Don Crumley, Chief, Simon, my dear Mary, and everyone else in between. They say crime never pays. In my book, it pays too well.